You guys are all set up. So for losers finals, we're gonna have Professing versus Rush on the YouTube.com. I don't know if I still have a co-commentator. I'm not sure. Oh no, it's back up. On the mic, we got myself, Azara, and we got uh, who are you, Lavin? Lavin. Lavin. Follow Lavin. me on Twitter Lavin. at uh, Lavin. At um. <laughs> As, at Ezraelite1760. That's that's my Twitter handle. Follow me. Let's go. Yo, we got Rush starting. We got Rush starting off with Ness. Rush going Ness. Okay. So Ness versus Bayo. Ness and Bayo. I, I. This is a really bad matchup for matchup for like, Ness. I can't fathom it. Oh man. So the neutral from Bayo is kind of coming in play, being patient, but at the same time picking the moments. Well, the lack there of neutral. Yeah, but lack of neutral. You, you, you pick you your don't battles. Have a choice, though. Yeah. As Bayo, you just pick your battles, and well, it's it's kind of hard for Ness really to get in. in this yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Do we see potential KO? Is that a, yes, we do. There's a KO. Star KO. Ness hits the screen. You know when you leave your mouth wide open for that for everybody to see? That's me. That's you? That's me every time I lose a stock. That's me every time I play Smash and you see my... You know, I'm really, I really wish we had the face cam here. The face cam would be great. I look like Ness on the face cam, to be honest. I leave my mouth but, open But too. where's your hat? Where's my hat? Yeah. Good question. If you would like to do donate, a, donate a hat, leave a comment section below. <laughs> donate a hat to Lavin so you can donate actually look like Ness on the face yep. cam next time. I'll bring a backpack too, just for a hell of it. If I get a Yo, recap. is it just me or is his backpack retardedly small? Like his backpack's tiny. What is what is this little guy carrying in his backpack? I don't know. I'm a big fan of Pokemon, and he can store a lot of stuff in a bag. Uh, honestly, I think that's gonna be a Pokemon trainer. I see it. I see it too. I also see him getting that back air a little bit earlier that we missed. That took off this stock. So I mean, he could get himself back in this game if he doesn't get KO'd by this uh, bayonetta combo. He gets the down throw to forward air. Let's go. Another Speaking forward air. Of Pokemon. And another one. Nope. Yes, he goes back he gets to, to grab turn. and catches Bayo. That's and, a good one. Yeah, that's nice, good. nice pun. Yeah. And Bayo's at 19 and Ness is at 78. And anyway, with four minutes left on the clock. It's not the magical percent, but I mean, we got four minutes yeah. left on the clock. Anything could happen. Including that stock just disappearing right now? No, he should live. Okay. Bayonetta jab is not the, uh, the easiest to kill. He recovers. I don't know if Bayo should be challenging that offstage. But the jump from the ledge got caught with a back air. So yeah, I mean. Bay Bayonetta, Bayonetta back air is such an amazing tool. No, no. Ooh. Is that a forward throw? That's a forward throw. He didn't catch the jump. Rush, did, Rush, Rush does make it back to stage. If you were Bayo right now, would you be nervous of a Ness back throw? Yes. Right, like right now? Like right always, now. yes. Always. I, I never want to get hit by Ness back throw. I don't know, maybe getting hit by a back throw is sometimes fun. <laughs> No, I'm just he is on the platform above. Him. Yeah, he is on the platform. He's at 66. He needs three more percent. Never and he got the cross up back. That was good. Dies at 177 from back here. Now we, I actually do see a legitimate counter pick right here. Yeah, I could see him switching maybe to Luigi or back to Sheik or to Sheik. We haven't seen Sheik this set, but he does play a lot. And they Sheik. did play earlier today too. Did they? Yeah, I believe so. I don't know. I don't think check professing a rush plays. Uh, I don't feel like checking the bracket. Okay. Well, we'll just go off of my word. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Maybe. But if I yeah. am right, it makes, it even, makes me look even better. Hopefully it goes up yeah. on YouTube and you're right. Yeah. He did switch to Luigi. We're back on Smash Bros. I, I do remember seeing. I don't Sheik. know what the ban was. Okay. We don't need to know the ban, but right now we're immediately in the game too. And we're seeing Bayo at 25 getting down throw combo. Oh no, misses his down throw combo. Bayonetta's trying to get something started up of her own. Let's see what Prof can do. From this matchup, I want to see Bayo off stage and getting uh, Cyclone to death. Wow. You, someone has a Bayonetta bias. To be fair, I'm not the biggest fan of Bayonetta either. I just want to see either player do their most optimal combos on each other. I want to see big damage. I want to see some good smash action. Something juicy, right? Something, something spicy. Hot and Muy fuego. Ooh, oh, and the down the, smash. No tech on That's that. That's really good. No tech on that down smash. Alright, the grab, up smash, into. Okay. 
Bayonetta's up B hitbox starts under her, for those who don't know. So uh, the reason why he shielded okay. after his up throw, I mean after his up smash, is so that he wouldn't get caught by the up air. I mean by the up B and uh, B sends into the air. Sure, I'll do random doubles. We're gonna do some random doubles after this. Uh, Jokes on him, I didn't say yes. After singles, though. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're still gonna be here. <laughs> yeah, true. This game is Man, in Russia's favor for now. Lu okay. Luigi, Luigi has a lot of trades. Luigi can trade a lot. Yeah, Nair and back air trade a lot with a lot of things. 51 and 52, never mind. We're for a second. Grab, down throw, fair. Turns back to neutral. Up air. Oh man, he got grabbed as soon as he landed again. He is just getting grabbed. He maybe Veo needs an afterburner kick going downward, right? I, I, maybe a secondary yeah. land, landing option because Rush is catching all of his landings with grabs. He is not letting this man stay. Yeah. Okay, we saw that. Oh, he, he goes for another grab. Wow. We need to see a witch time, all right? You want to see witch time, Mithra? If a witch time happens, then this this game's over. <laughs> And if Luigi gets an up smash, this game's over. This game is really even right now. He goes for the cycle and just keep himself safe, come back onto the stage. One if that had got shielded, that would have been a stop. What's the kill? Do you know Luigi's kill throw right now at the moment? Um, Probably back throw. Up throw will not kill. You'd have to pivot throw. back throw. Forward throw may kill? Oh, almost. It didn't, almost. Maybe a little bit more pum pummeling. I would have assumed he was going to go for a pivot back throw, but he didn't. But he does Nair. get the Nair to kill. Nair. Wow. That was a sneaky Nair. Just threw out his dirty little Luigi foot. <laughs> Maybe next one I go to, I should put four his, Ray Ray's controllers. His plumber shoe. Ray, can I have my controller back? <laughs> can I have my controller back? The white one? <laughs> four Ray's controller. We need to be double. Yeah. It's 7.30. You know, out of all the TCG packs you bought, I still have all of them. We got a if game three going your, on. On uh, Dreamland. Prof is already trying his best to just keep Luigi keep, 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 keep Rush from landing. <laughs> so all the cards like, huh? You normally leave him on the table and I bring him home with me. I mean, it gives me something to look at. It's okay. Don't throw him away, just give him to me. Wait, what That's the pack, I mean the cards that you leave left over. Not you don't to say want. that all I can't be, but I mean Prof is playing this. Prof is playing this very safe on that top platform a second ago. Need me? Yeah. Alright, we're gonna hop off for a little bit. Sorry about that, you had to hear me talk about Pokemon. Nice. Now we can talk about solo smash. Maybe it's just me on commentary, maybe we got another commentator coming up. Joining me on the mic, we're going to have uh, BMC Walter. If I could find a way to unmute his mic. Right. Rush does make it back to the... Ooh, and takes the, the backer. With a fellow learning player, Ezra, he's slowly climbing up the ranks. Yo, honestly, I'm just here for the commentary. <laughs> really? Yeah, I just I love commentary. That's, that's what that's awesome. what we're here to do now. That's good. You can be like our dedicated commentator. Um, but you, I was watching this match earlier in Prof. Yeah, what do you... Uh, really good at is, uh, you camp right there, and then if you try to poke him, he usually probably shoot it and then pounce on you, and then catch you with Veo combos. Oh, that was oh. sick. That was sick. But, uh, I mean, it, it also helps that up B starts under her, so yeah. if you if you just slightly come above the platform, you get hit by the up B as well. Oh, he did he even to him. That's right. You know, he's really been relying on that slide on the side B. Mm -hmm. uh, you gotta follow her. And as long as she doesn't go to the ledge, you can yeah, punish yeah, the landing. Uh, you don't do that I think what he's doing is he's trying to just wait out and not get hit by the witch time. But I mean, you gotta go for it. Yeah. You gotta at least try to do something. Is he witch time at all this time? He's he's tried to witch time coming down. Uh, stock one. He was coming down off of the the left the right platform on out. He did get an up there. That was something. Yeah. All right. Misses the forward air though. 
that down so oh that was he held shield for a long time stayed really safe for he also he thought he was gonna roll so he ran forward and prof just stayed in shield gets the up air chases him it's a tide kick you know, every time I see that Bandana has a dive kick, I'm just like, I did not know this was a fighting oh. game. Gets the back air. Is that going to seal out the stock? Such a greedy side oh, all right. He does side B the ledge that time. Not as bad. If he snaps the ledge, it's fine. But if he just goes to the stage, it's so greedy. It's greedy, but it'll start up, you know, a chain of Bandana stuff and yeah. hopefully ends the stock. No, no, no. It's just shield. Obviously, the answer there is the shield because she can't grab you in the air. Yeah, and yeah. you can just up smash her out of shield at that point. There it is, there's the back end. Sealing out game three. That was another no no. He didn't go too far above the ledge. Rush just caught it. Yeah. It's, it's just definitely safer ways that Bandana can get to the ledge. Like a lot safer ways. Yeah, go you have two up you have two yeah, side Yeah, You have a lot of options. You have your jump. Even which time as you're coming to the ledge, so if they're hitting you, they get which time do you get to grab yeah. the ledge for free, you know? He'd only other, he'd only used it one other time, so. I wonder what um, states they're going to now. It's pretty pivotal. Um, one thing that was different from the past set when Rush went Luigi is that Ross edge guarding was actually really good. Like, he would you saw, you were commenting. Yeah, of course, yeah, definitely. guarding was really good, and he hasn't really been edge guarding that much. There's been I think that much it, opportunity. I think it's just because he's playing against, like, you know, Bayo. No, I meant, um, Prof edge guarding. Oh, uh, Prof edge guarding, right? Yeah. Okay. Are they staying? Okay, he's switching. He's switching to, to Fox. I. <sighs> there it goes. Okay. I was. Because I, I honestly don't think that he should have switched yeah. to Fox for this. I think his bayonetta can do it. Yeah, sure. The last time he switched to Fox, he was actually winning. Mm -hmm. But. He got, he got tornado again. Once, yeah, but, and that's exactly why I didn't yeah. think that it's a good idea because it's so easy to just get Fox off stage, yeah. and his, his his off stage options are very limited. Not like yeah. Bayonetta. Yeah, exactly. You can't run it down there and shine you. I mean, you can, but it won't do anything. I wish Shine worked the way it does in Melee. So, so for so for the the viewers on YouTube who don't know how good Melee fo uh, Fox Down B is, Fox and Falco, well mainly Fox. Um, there's enough hits done. You can die probably zero percent. Most characters. Yeah. If, you're out of your jump and Fox goes down there and hits you. It always has a set knockback. Even at zero, it's gonna send you far down. It's gonna kill you. And you but can also use it to combo for wave shines and stuff like that. One thing that in this, in this, uh, basically Luigi has shine spike. It's continuing to get. It's pretty much shine spike. Yeah. Oh no! Look at that. Wow. His combos conversions are so so good. He's keeping them at the top, the very top of the the twist. So when he no, pops out at yeah, the end, yeah. And there, he goes up higher. So there's, he's not going on the side where he gets launched to the left. And he's correct, going straight up. Correct me if I'm wrong. The single hit um, witch twist sends him higher, yeah, correct? Okay. Yeah, it does. And uh, you can't. That's like pretty much death, honestly. Because like you, you, you can't SDI, SDI it. it. It's only one hit. Well, you can, but you, you would have to SDI the first hit perfectly. And that's almost impossible. Oh, look at that. Is, it, is, is that this it? game. See, this game might already be over. Oh, oh my god. He really went for the greed, but I mean, he's got a whole stock to play with at this point. Oh. Man. He really wants to game take five. this nice to a game five. I miss you. Yes. Better right. Christian. This can still be totally doable. He got unfortunately grabbed on the, on the platform, platform forward through. Yeah. Oh, he, he, oh my god. He didn't go for the witch yeah. time right there. That's what I was expecting. Right. Prof's just trying to play safe. Oh my god. Hey, it's not bad. You only took an up here. Oh, that kicks the lag platform. F them up right there. This is the scary part. Oh, that's good ground. Yeah, if Luigi gets one opening, like, he could make this a conversion to a stop. And that is it. Wow, look at that. We're going to a game five. This is a good set. Really is. Yeah, I, I don't... I don't see the need for, uh... Professing to switch or rush to switch. I think game five they should just go into it. Yep. Uh, I think either of them switching off is a bad idea. It can go either way, honestly. Um, as long as Prof, like, he kind of got unfortunately grabbed on that platform. He shouldn't have died on regular circumstances. Mm -hmm. If he just avoid that, he could, like, potentially two star. Because he was running away with that game ridiculously. 
wasn't uh, if I was villain, I would take Bayonetta to FD. Yeah, Bayonetta has less places to land um, whenever yeah. there's no platform. So, I mean, I, I agree with you there. Yeah, so there's no mix-up. It's just, you know, oh, she's going to either go to the ledge or she's going to land on stage and you get to, you get the free punish. Especially because you, you see him drop, right, on the platform. So you would always wait there. He'll wait on the top. He'll wait on the sides, yeah. And if you if you go next to him, down tilt, up beat, like. Well, I don't know if he can. Lilat. Uh, Lilat. This is actually a really, really yeah. good stage. Yeah, that's a really good stage for Bayo. Bayo can shark under the platform ridiculously. I wouldn't say as good as Meta Knight and Brawl, but yeah. Bayonetta has a lot of oh, stuff to do on this stage. So. And, and her bullets, look at Russia's shield. Yeah, look at her bullets. They come up perfectly straight on the on, on yep. Yeah. And they become the best, almost the best projectile in the game. At least on this stage, yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. It, it does the same thing for uh, Toon Link's yeah. uh, Toon Link's neutral B. Uh, one thing uh, I was hoping in there because he hit and he upbeat. I was hoping he was going to punish him. Yeah. They cover so much of the stage now that this you is Lila. And you can't jump over a punch. Well, you probably could. That's such a huge commitment. Look at that. Especially because, you know, Bayonetta uh, can cancel her oh. her neutral beat. This is such a good set. Like, playing this oh, look at that. One thing I, oh, and that is a stock dang. Bayonetta. One thing, oh, one thing I really like about Prof is he plays, like, the matchup. Like, you know... Really textbook. Like, oh, yeah. you know, Lila. Oh, no, gonna get exact. no, no, no. He makes it back. Uh, he yeah, did not use yeah. his jump. That was really smart. Jump, yeah. um, but one thing, you know, he realizes, oh, Bayonetta has all these options here. He's going to use that totally on his advantage. It's yeah, almost like fighting a different Bayonetta. Yeah, he's not trying to play the the, uh, the mind game. He's just trying to play the matchup of these yeah. two characters. Look, right now. Right now, he's spacing out with, with aerials, and he's just trying to keep himself safe. Doesn't want to really go in. If I were him, I would play really camp. I'm, I'm hoping to see a bunch of neutral, yeah. but I mean, he's just, he wants to go in for kills. Oh, yeah. Such a good oh, okay, grab him. No, that's not too bad. Oh. The stage positioning is all prof now. He got it back. Like right now, like, it's crazy because he's fighting him. And he doesn't have to fight him. He can just shoot back bullets. You know, first stock, he just tilt Dylan. You know, I know. Oh, oh no, is that going to be it? I know you're not a huge fan of. <laughs> oh no, yeah, but yeah. I mean, if you if anything anything to, to if you're already in the yeah. lead, I totally I totally yeah. understand camp. Yeah, you, you understand it, and you understand like it can be very frustrating. It can yeah. it, it's it's not the most fun thing to play against, yeah. but what it does is it flushes your opponent and makes them exactly. possibly make mistakes trying to rush in. Exactly, and that's totally the problem. Because I, I do look, the same thing in fighting games. I used to play Morgan in oh, no, oh uh, Ultra Three. Yeah, I played more I played Morgan Doom and um oh, Morgan cool. Doom and Magneto. So oh. <laughs> that was a that was a really good up smash. She yeah. caught it. He might not get too much off this. He he does he does like avoid the first the second grab. Okay, punishes it with bear. Oh. Rush is trying his best to bring this back. Alright, that was good. He was expecting the back air. He didn't get some oh, bullets. He did the second afterburner kick instead, correct? Yeah, and so usually what Prof's been doing is he did afterburner kick back. Into back air, yeah. Oh my god, so good. So good awareness to switch it up. And this is ridiculous. He he literally cannot come in. And he can't shield them for too long because he'll get oh shield poked. Oh my god, And god, you can just cancel it. Him. This is amazing. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is the power of it. Oh, oh my and that might be it. Yeah. Dang. Oh man, now Walt has got to go play Grand Finals yeah. against, uh, against Professor. Good commentating with Ezra. Really good set. That was a wonderful set. Good stuff. I want some boneless Bayonetta, please. Can I get that?